Hello and welcome to this case compatibility test video for the Note 8 Whitestone Dome Protector. We've received an unbelievable response from Whitestone users wanting to know which cases would work with this fantastic protector on the Galaxy Note 8. We'll start off by testing the entire official Samsung range of cases with the two-piece pop cover up first. With a very slim design, the case when attached works flawlessly with the Whitestone Dome protector as you can see. Next we'll be testing the official Alcantara cover. Slipping easily onto the phone, the Alcantara also works perfectly with the protector attached. Now we move on to the protective standing cover from Samsung which has been highly requested. And we can confirm that this fits perfectly also with a nice gap between the case and the protector. Penultimately from Samsung we have the clear view cover, which also worked a treat thanks to the slim internal housing. Finally from Samsung we have the LED view cover which like the clear view works perfectly meaning that all of the official Note 8 cases are compatible. Now we'll be taking a look at a selection of cases from Elixir, with the first up being their ultra thin case which as you can see fits fine. Moving on we see the Flexi Shield, a slightly thicker gel case than the ultra thin that also works with no issues at all. Now we move on to a more stylish two piece option which is the Elixir X Duo and just like the other cases from Elixir, this one also works a treat. Finally from Elixir we'll be testing the Armadillo Tough case which also works perfectly, although as with any two piece case we do advise applying it in stages so as to avoid any unwanted pressure on the protector. Now we'll be taking a look at a couple of cases from Rinky, and first up is their Fusion Series case which did slightly lift the protector away in the corner as you can see. However their slim case did work perfectly although some of the damage caused by the Fusion case was still visible. Next up we'll be testing the UAG Plasma series which due to the robust shock absorbing corners really lifted the protector and caused a problem instantly, meaning that this case was definitely not compatible. After the UAG's failure we move on to cases from VRS Design and first up is their dandy layered wallet case which provided tons of room and fitted perfectly. Next up from VRS is their Hypro Shield which again worked fine and provided a great fit. Just like their next case, the Damda Slide which also fitted well with the Whitestone Dome applied. Finally we'll be testing one of the most rugged cases available which is the Defender series from Ottobox. I must admit I was very surprised that this worked as well as it did. I believe the reason that such a heavy duty case is fitted fine is down to the multi layered application. By securing the case in stages, the overlapping front panel actually holds the protector in place with no issues at all. So out of the cases tested, only two failed, meaning that the majority of cases on the market will be fine so long as they have a little give and don't feature corners or raised lips that greatly overlap. We'll be testing even more cases in the coming days and providing results on our blog which I'll leave a link to in the description below. For links to all cases featured within this video please see the links in the comments below.